good evening all the candidates uh, from andhra pradesh andhra pradesh government of andhra pradesh there is a great opportunity we can see here 4755 uh, vacancies for the post of uh, mid level health provider there is a great opportunity from uh, ap government ठीक है जो होने जा रहा है दैट शुड बी हेल्ड जोन वाइज वी कैन सी हेयर जस्ट लाइक दिस जैसे कि आप लोग देख पा रहे हैं यहाँ पे uh, जैसे कि आपका नाइन नाइन हंड्रेड सेवेंटी फोर वैकेंसीज जो कि जून जोन वन दैट इज एट विशाखापटनम एंड द फोर्टीन हंड्रेड फोर्टी सिक्स वैकेंसीज जोन टू दैट इज ऑन राजमंड्री थर्ड वैकेंसी वॉज नाइनटीन हंड्रेड सिक्सटी सेवन वैकेंसीज दैट इज ऑन जोन थ्री गुंटूर एंड द फोर्थ वन वैकेंसी वॉज थर्टीन हंड्रेड सिक्सटी एट वैकेंसीज दैट इज ऑन जोन फोर्थ कड़प्पा दैट इज द होल नंबर ऑफ वैकेंसीज फोर थाउजेंड सेवन हंड्रेड फिफ्टी फाइव हुईच विल बी कंडक्टेड हुईच हुईच कैन बी हुईच हुईच कैन बी कंडक्टेड फॉर द पोस्ट ऑफ मिड लेवल हेल्थ प्रोवाइडर बाई द आंध्र प्रदेश गवर्नमेंट चलिए यहां पे हम देख सकते हैं जैसे जैसे कि इसका क्वालिफिकेशन द रिक्वायर्ड क्वालिफिकेशन फॉर द पोस्ट मिड लेवल हेल्थ प्रोवाइडर दैट इज द बेसिक बेसिक क्वालिफिकेशन इज कंप्लीटेड बी एस सी नर्सिंग यू कैन यू कैन सी एयर द बेसिक क्वालिफिकेशन इज रिक्वायर्ड फॉर मिड लेवल हेल्थ प्रोवाइडर that is uh, bsc nursing uh, from a recognized university and a registered and a registered in ap nursing council the all the candidates who has passed bsc nursing those are compulsory to registered in andhra pradesh nursing council that is the first criteria and the second criteria uh, they have studied the certificate program for uh, community health this was this cpcs as integrated certificate program in bsc nursing and this is also the mandatory requirement other than other than this no candidates uh, can be apply for this uh, mid level health provider uh, recruitment the next another thing thing uh, that that was uh, this is Uh, the candidates must not have completed 35 years on the date of uh, issue of applications or in case of uh, bc backward classes uh, uh, schedule, uh, schedule caste schedule tribe physically handicapped and ex servicemen the candidates those those uh, have not completed 40 years they should be within uh, 40 years the next thing is that the method of appointment the appointment uh, here we can see the method of appointment is purely on contract basis for uh, the period of one year uh, for the one year on contract basis you should be you, you must be appointed after the completion of uh, one year contract you should, the candidate should, the candidate should be renewed on the basis of the performance and availability of funds of state government as per their pro candidate for performance their uh, renewal uh, procedures that should be maintained next point that is the selection criteria next purely the selection uh, the selection uh, criteria is based on the marks obtained in the bsc nursing purely the selection the selection procedure that will be uh, held on the basis of marks obtained in the bsc nursing course is the criteria for uh, selection so uh, i i i would like to advise all the candidates uh, of andhra uh, government uh, they should uh, they should be very clear the about the selection criteria and selection criteria is uh, that that should be uh, done on the basis of marks obtained in the bsc nursing a, a team as a committee a committee a committee along with the director of public health and uh, family welfare स्टेट प्रोग्राम मैनेजर एन एच एम चीफ एडमिनिस्ट्रेटिव अफिसर एन एच एम एडिशनल डायरेक्टर एम एच एम प्रोग्राम अफिसर एच डब्ल्यू सी ऑल द ऑल दोज द अपॉइंट्स ऑल दोज अपॉइंट्स आर विद इन द सिलेक्शन कमिटी 
next things are like this the candidate uh, shall submit the applications online all the candidates are requested to submit their application online only through their their website the website is that and uh, all candidates are requested to submit all the applications through uh, this website only no applications will received physically if if anybody wants to uh, send uh, the application by the post or physically handover there is no applications uh, will be accepted the another things uh, all the uh, what are the documents uh, that should be submitted that should be uploaded um, this was like that first thing was uh, passport size photographs the another things jo uh, ssc certificate senior secondary school certificates and equivalent, equivalent uh, examinations third things that is the intermediate examination we can say that 10 plus 2 examination uh, certificates and mark sheet also the fourth one is bsc nursing examination uh, pass certificates fifth one mark sheet of bsc nursing all years the sixth one uh, sixth one is the certificate of permanent registration the certificate of uh, permanent registration in andhra pradesh nursing and midwives council should be enclosed in case of the fresh pass outs undertaking shall be given that the registration certificate will be submitted before issue of the appointment orders here is a point the point is saying that all the uh, all the members who are applying for the uh, post uh, the post is mid level health provider they should they should have a certificate of permanent registration so that they can apply for the post otherwise otherwise they are not all, they are not provisionally selected for the uh, uh, selection process again one thing he is saying in case of uh, fresh pass out candidates undertaking uh, shall be given an undertaking that should be given by the candidates in that undertaking the uh, individual will promise that he will hand over the registration certificate before the appointment of uh, uh, appointment orders issue of appointment orders copy of caste certificates the candidates belongs to uh, the candidates belongs to uh, sc scheduled scheduled caste scheduled tribes backward classes and economically weaker sections with categorization all the candidates have to uh, take the certificates caste certificate from the revenue authority and submit during the document verification as well as have to uploaded the websites during the online applications the eighth, eighth thing that was the study certificates that is uh, the certificates regard regarding uh, re, uh, certificates is required for fourth class to 10th class from where the candidate studied in that certificate this was the summary that the candidate have studied from uh, where and which organization that is from fourth to 10th class the ninth thing was the copy of certificate for physically handicapped that is more than 40% benchmark which was uh, physical handicapped candidates by the um, with the certificate that was approved by the, uh, the uh, uh, chief medical officer of the district or sub division sub sub division uh, sub division levels the 10th thing the 10th thing that was the copy of certificate of ex-servicemen if uh, any uh, any defense employees ex employees are applying for this post they have to attach the copy of uh, ex-servicemen certificates the 11th thing is that you can see here the copy of certificate in the support of sports quota if any candidates belongs to sports quota and uh, any candidates demands uh, the reservation of sports quota so he has to he, he or she has to uh, produce the sports certificate next another thing uh, the rda uh, rdm and hs will scrutinize all the applications after the completion submission of the all applications the committee will scrutinize all the applications and uh, publish a pro provisional merit, merit list in the website so all the candidates 
who has uh, who are interested to apply for the post after uh, after su complete uh, successful completion of the application you should follow the website follow the website for the provisional merit list either you are uh, provisionally selected or not so that you can get confirmed by the website the another uh, another things is that uh, this is here at every stages of recruitment uh, sms will be sent short message uh, service sms will be sent to the candidates on the recruitment informations so all the candidates they should follow up uh, the website regularly and uh, all the all the activities on the during the recruitment process all the informations um, by the recruitment committee should inform they should inform the candidates through the sms the next uh, next point is that uh, counseling will be conducted uh, for the allocation of places of postings and the posting orders shall be issued to the selected mlhp uh, mid level health providers in this point uh, the, the, it was uh, it is stated that after the complete selection procedures the candidates who are selected for the post they said uh, they they have uh, um, um, there will uh, be a counseling uh, organized organized by the, uh, the selection committee and all the candidates who, who are selected for the uh, selected finally selected uh, they should be count, count, they should uh, this uh, all the candidates are provided a counseling and there uh, the, all the directions uh, given at the time of uh, posting and uh, the places of vacancy the next point is all the candidates we can see here the next uh, uh, all the candidates who are selected and appointed as mlhp mid level health providers shall report to the place of posting within, within one week from the date of issue of the appointment letters in this point uh, the statement was uh, in this in this point the sentence, the points the points was rela um, related to all the uh, uh, selected uh, the candidates are directed to report to the place of posting within one week from the date of appointment letters there is the schedule of recruitment we can see here uh, date of notification uh, was 6 april 2022 start of re receipt of application 7 april 2022 last date for receipt of application that is 16 april 2022 date of publish uh, provisional merit list 20 april 2022 last date for receipt of objection in provisional merit list you can also uh, give the objections if any that is uh, 23 23 april, april 2022 the next one the next point is the date of application of final merit list and provisional selection uh, list that is uh, 25th april 2022 last date for receipt of objection for provisional selection uh, list that is 26 april 2022 date of application of final merit list that is uh, 27 april 2022 and date of counseling date of counseling of all selected candidates for the post that is 28 to 30th april 2022 this was the complete notification this was the complete details in regard of the uh, post of mid mid level health provider notifications i think all the candidates uh, belongs to ap ap government ap state they should understand the clear the detailed information i have said best from uh, best wishes from my heart i i am going to close uh, this video jai hind jai bharat